Hello, welcome to my kitchen. My name is Bonnie. Tonight I'm making asparagus rolled in phyllo dough, and it's stuffed with Philadelphia cream cheese. And what we want to do to start is preheat your oven to 400 degrees. Have everything prepped. You want your asparagus cut, um, washed, cut, dried. Make sure the asparagus is dry. And you're going to take your cream cheese. We're going to add a squirt of lemon, about a teaspoon of lemon, a little cayenne pepper just to kick it up a notch, and a little salt and pepper. This is a very simple recipe. It's been a hit for my friends and family. It can be both an appetizer and a side dish. I've had it in both capacities. So after you blend up the, the cream cheese, which by the way you need to leave sit out so it softens up. I'm going to take your asparagus, take a fork, rub it on there. Now you could use a pastry bag and thin it up a little bit more, but it's much better this way. You're going to melt some butter and I'm going to brush it on your, your phyllo dough. Phyllo dough is being a little, a little particular tonight, jumping all over the place. Now I like to use two slices of phyllo. Second slice. Now with phyllo dough, you want to work it pretty fast because if it sits out too long, it gets a little hard. You can still work it. So take your asparagus. I like to put two per. Uh, wrap. Here's your next one. This is such a good dish. So easy to do. Roll it up. And put a little bit of butter right at the top. Hold it together nicely. I have a few here that I've already done. Then what you want to do is brush the top with the butter. I know butter goes good with everything. Now let's see this again one more time. Take a piece of phyllo, a little butter, the second piece on top. There we go. More butter. Smear of cream cheese on there. Mm mm, this is so good. I have friends and family begging me for the recipe. A little bit of a schmear. This is a fun dish. Goes good with chicken, meat, fish. It's very versatile. It's great to bring to a party if you need to bring a little appetizer. A little bit of dab of duck butter on here. A little bit on the top. Then I like to finish it off with a little Parmigiana Reggiana. One of my favorite cheeses. Along with Philadelphia brand cream cheese, which I grew up with. I'm from the Philadelphia area. So, I'm going to take this, pop it in our oven. Pull out the ones that I cooked earlier. Okay. Take our plate. Look how pretty these are. Cut one of these so you can see what it looks like. Oh, look at that. Mm mm, good. Mmm, so good. As I said, oh, nice and hot. Ooh, makes a great side dish or a good appetizer. 
for your guests, your friends and family. Oh, and look who's here. Paula herself. There you go, Paula. Enjoy. Thanks for coming to my kitchen. Have a good day.